it detonates a landmine while trying to aim. Oh! <laughs> Yo, we did it, guys. We did it. <laughs> Finally, we can start the Hunger Games. Are you guys ready? Um, actually, it looks a little... <laughs> oh, it oh, yeah, we didn't have to change Benito's. I'm so happy we didn't have to change Benito's. Uh, also, all the all the images are skewed a little bit. That's fine. We <laughs> have nothingness. Which is just okay. Okay, this is good. This is good. This will be good, guys. Are you ready? Uh, <laughs> uh, proceed. Okay, all the tributes stand on their podiums. The horn sounds. Lapis Foss runs away from the co cornucopia. Prayer Foss runs away from the cornucopia. Pebble snatches a bottle of alcohol <laughs> and a rag. Lore Ack. Euclid takes a handful of throwing knives. Uh, Invasion Foss takes a handful of throwing. That's that's also that's lore accurate right there. Invasion Foss takes a handful of. Antark runs away from the cornucopia. Shattered Foss sets sets an explosive off. Also lore killing depression, <laughs> guys. We did it. We've killed depression. Oh, Mercury Foss. Mercury Foss did not last long. Sad and Rutile. Rutile is gone. Killing de. Shattered Foss sets off an explosive, killing depression. It's so funny. Rock Foss grabs a shield, leaning leaning on the cornucopia. Padpa grabs a shield, leaning on the cat cornucopia. Cinnabar grabs a jar of fishing bait, while Karen Gorm gets fishing gear. Uh, Acnea runs away from the cornucopia. Beneteau runs away from the cornucopia. Sonic Foss runs away from the cornucopia. Moon Foss runs away from the cornucopia. <laughs> Post Winter Foss runs away from the Brongo receives a trident from inside the cornucopia. Brongo with a trident is an image. That is a visceral image right there. I need fan art of just Brongo with a trident. He didn't ascend from the sea and he I okay, new fan art idea for Pitapat. Uh Venture Post grabs a shovel. Congo breaks <laughs> That is, that, <laughs> I have to screenshot that one. I think that's the funniest one so far. <laughs> oh no, no, Congo was being too lore accurate. Truly. Okay. Um, ghost takes a sickle from inside the Keratocopia. This is also accurate. Lore accurate. <laughs> Proceed. <clears throat> Prayer Foss is prick is pricked by thorns while picking berries. Uh, Ghost searches for a water source. Padba cannot handle the circumstance. <laughs> um, I'm sorry. <laughs> that, that's not allowed. You can't do that in the Jose Kanu universe. You can't do this in the Jose Kanu universe. Um, it's just not allowed. Unacceptable. Um, Shattered Foss tends to you this, this This is also not more accurate in any way. Shattered Foss, I wanna I can't screenshot every single interaction. I'll I'll have the video, we'll have the VOD. Um Shattered Foss tends to Euclid's wounds. Of course, of course. Brongo constructs a shank. <laughs> Brongo is the I, I'm cheering for Brongo to win. Honestly, Benito Pebble, Vendricosis, and Lapis Foss hunt for other tributes. Okay, Antark Rock Foss, Sonic Foss, uh, and Moon Foss, and raid Congo's camp while while he is hunting. <laughs> this is such a whack team right here. Moon Foss, Sonic Foss, Rock Foss, and Antark. Antark is the <laughs> odd one out here raiding Congo's camp. <laughs> they're avenging who? They're avenging people, I guess. Um. Acnea collects fruit from a tree. He's getting he's getting the forbidden fruit. That's what he's doing. Uh, Satan cosplaying. Karen Gurm overhears Invasion Foss and Cinnabar talking in the distance. <laughs> it's just so funny. Kar Karen Gorm overhears Invasion Foss and Cinnabar talking. To what are they talking about? <laughs> Them having their like mid battle speech and Karen Gorm like comes down from the moon like yo just wanted to ears eavesdrop. Um, <laughs> 
Yo, Pongos are winner, guys. Uh, Post Winter Foss receives medical supplies from an unknown sponsor. That's us right there. The unknown sponsor is just us. Because we also want P Post Winter Foss to be okay. Uh, baby Foss searches for a water source. Uh, four cannon uh, shots can be heard in the distance. Um, Depression! District 5, gone. Mercury Foss, District 9. We only got to see Ichikawa's lovely art for a little bit. Rutile, District 11. Padpa, District 11. Padpa and Rutile immediately died. <laughs> Both of them. Um, I feel bad for Padpa there, but... Wait, who killed them? Who killed these three? Wasn't it, um... Wasn't it Shattered Foss who killed Depression, Mercury Foss, and Rutile? So funny. Uh, see, everyone's status. Oh yeah, just who's dead and who's alive. Okay, go back to the Okay, proceed. Benito and Karen Gorm talk about the tributes still alive. Ben <laughs> just love Benito again, it's so funny. Poster winner fun troll. <laughs> <laughs> Things cannot go any more not lore accurate than in- I need to screenshot that one too. Post Winter Foss tracks down and kills Antark. <laughs> so lore accurate, man. Um, okay. Mm. Okay. Moon Foss sets up a ca sets up camp for the night. Moon Foss is being sane. Mentricostis and Acnea talk about tr the tributes still alive and how to murder them. Probably. Rock Foss convinces Sonic Foss to s to snuggle with him. Uh, <laughs> okay. Foss has just found a rock of the same material and is just giving it a hug. Shattered Foss looks at the night sky. Um, Shattered Foss is vengefully looking at the moon. Uh, Euclid, Lapis Foss, Brongo, and Cinnabar. Another whack combo of characters. Euclid, Lapis... Have, have any of these characters... Interaction. <laughs> Euclid, Lapis Foss, Brongo, and Cinnabar tell each other ghost stories to lighten the mood. Very lovely. Dream team right here, obviously. Baby Foss receives a hatchet from an unknown sponsor. Who gave Foss a hatchet? <laughs> um, Antart tagged along thinking they were gonna throw a surprise party for Congo. Yeah, well now I can send my send you my artworks. I'm gonna draw a Zeki no Kuni Hunger Games now. <laughs> this is so funny. What is going on? Hello, Yue. Did you just join back? We're doing a Zeki no Kuni Hunger Games. <laughs> Yue, it's Hunger Games, but Land of the Lustrous. No, boss, you're doing it wrong. <laughs> no. This is the best thing I've ever seen. Every decision in my life led up to this moment and this moment only. Oh, this is so good. Uh, Congo banishes Bear Foss. What? Head... Congo bashes Prayer Foss's head with a maze. <laughs> um, canon? Canon? This is, guys, this is 107 confirmed. This is exactly what will happen in 107, is everything that's happening right now. This is ju just is in San Jose Kunu Invasion Foss tends to ghost wounds. Okay, why is Invasion Foss the healer? That's gotta be the craziest decision that's happening right here, is Invasion Foss, I think, tended to someone else's wounds in the last one, right? Or else Invasion Foss and Ghost are just besties for some reason. <laughs> um, I joined back the second I saw the message in the meme channel. <laughs> I'm glad that you were summoned back. What is happening? I don't even know what to say to this. Congo is a mess. Has, does Congo have two kills and both of them are Foss? No. Yeah. Congo has just been mean to Foss. That's all Congo has been doing. Uh, Pebble falls into a frozen lake and drowns. How does Pebble drown? Okay. Pebble. Pebble. Um, this is this, a frozen lake. This is Pitapat. Pitapat uh, in the ice flows um, hated Pe Pebble, apparently. This is some whack universe. Karen Gorn thinks about home. I don't think Karen Gorn would ever do that. Um, okay, this, this is lore accurate right here. Lapis, Foss, Vendricosis, and Congo track down and kill Acme. <laughs> Although, isn't that what Acme wants? <laughs> it's so complicated. Uh, 107 spoiler. Pebble, no. Like, seriously, who wrote this? 
Yes. Yo, what's up with Con- what's up with Congo? Maybe when Congo is not broken, he's totally reversed. Maybe, maybe this is what Congo was supposed to be. I mean, his his job was to pray for the humans to go away. Acme Acme just wants to return to nothingness. Congo is now doing his job. Congo is no longer defective and is setting them on their way. <laughs> Congo is a menace. Lapis Boss Ventricus has gone to track down and kill Acme. Lord, lovely. Euclid overhears Cinnabar and Post Winter Foss ta- talking in the distance. Cinnabar is talking to every Foss form, which is honestly lore accurate. Um, <laughs> let's go. Wait, hold on. Thank God Acme has gone. Salutation. I mean, yeah. You, you okay? Uh, Shattered Foss makes a slingshot out of what? <laughs> Shattered Foss, like the menace of what shat- the like amalgamation of what Shattered Foss looks like, and then then them just with a slingshot is so funny. Benito begs for Moon Foss to. <laughs> he refuses, keeping Benito alive. <laughs> why is this also just lore accurate? <laughs> That's why Karen Gorm is thinking about home because their man is gone. I guess so. Hey, Karen Cinnabar is a bro. Cinnabar is a bro. <clears throat> Benito begs for me. <laughs> Benito, are you all right? Benito, you have a gun. Your profile picture has a gun. You can do it yourself. Um, anyway, uh, Rock Foss makes a wooden spear. <laughs> Rock, Rock Foss is doing so much. <laughs> um, Sonic Foss stabs Invasion Foss. Sonic Foss stabs Invasion Foss in the back with a trident. That's, that's... This is so wacky. It just reading these sentences, like, just do not compute in my brain because of how ridiculous they are. Ghost receives clean water from an unknown sponsor. Ghost is just living their life. <laughs> Baby Foss sets off an explosive. Is killing Brongo. No, guys! Brongo's dead. <laughs> Pitapat's dead. No. <laughs> I wanted Pitapat to win. That, that's who I was cheering for. Um, I can't believe Baby Foss killed Pitapat. No way, man. Okay. Benito just points a gun to Foss's head while begging to be killed. When Foss wants Benito to suffer. Foss down. Uh, Baby Foss, no. Yeah, f- oh, yeah, I guess that is. Yeah, Sonic Foss stabs Invasion Foss. That is just Foss stabs Foss in the back of a trident. All right. Um, so, six, wait. Six cannon shots can be heard in this- Wait, how did Antark die? Can I go back? How do I go back? Wait, can I just do this? Wait, Antark died? When did Antark die? How did Antark die? When did Antark die? Oh, post- Oh, I forgot about that! Post- <laughs> Winter Foss drags down and kills Antark. I completely forgot that post Winter Foss killed Antark. My bad. Um. <laughs> okay. Uh, sorry, sorry, I just forgot about that. So, Antark! <laughs> this is what I've done to you guys. <clears throat> I'm so glad it worked. Antark, District 2, dead. Everyone celebrate. Um, <laughs> no, no, that was my boy. Baby Foss wins, no problem, no. A Prayer Foss, District 5, died. I forgot who killed Prayer Foss. I think- Oh, Congo! Congo killed Prayer Foss. That's right. Um, Pebble, District 10, dead. Te- Pebble drowned. I don't know how a Pebble drowns. But Pebble Drowned. So far, no Foss has killed another Foss. Let's think about that. Acnea was a group effort. We're glad that Acnea is gone. I didn't want Acnea to win. Foss is no chill, get it? And oh no, Fo- oh no, Foss killed Invasion Foss. I didn't realize that Invasion Foss died. I guess stabbed in the back of a trident. I was just thinking about how Invasion Foss could, could. I can't. Which Foss did that? Sonic Foss killed Inva- Invasion Foss with a trident, and Baby Foss killed Brongo. This is so wild. I love it. Okay. Who do you think's gonna win? Give your bets. Wait, can I do a poll? Can't you do a poll? Who's, who's, uh, see everyone's status. Who's alive? Baby Foss is alive, Ventricosis is alive. Okay, I'm gonna do a poll. So we're just gonna Foss as one entity. Foss, Ghost, or Karen Gorm. Same character. Uh, there's nothing wrong with me saying that. Ghost and Karen Gorm are totally the same character. Um... Who else is there? Ventricosis? Who else is- Ventricosis Euclid. Oh, yeah. Alright, guys, there's now a poll. Who do you think is gonna win? So, currently, uh, it's still this way. So we have 50% Foss, uh, 12% for Karen- Ghost or Karen Gorm, and 38% for Congo, Cinnabar, or Benito. 
No one thinks Ventricosis or Euclid is going to win. I guess we'll see. All right. <clears throat> Go back to the poem tributes. Uh, proceed. A uh, moon foss is unable. I'm going to zoom in. Yeah. Moon foss is unable to start a fire and sleeps without warmth. <laughs> moon foss is unable to start a fire. They canonically have never seen fire in the Gem Society. That's another weird lore book fact that I think is funny. Um, this is why why Moon Foss is unable to start a fire. Congo and Euclid tell stories about themselves to each other. This is all, this is lore accurate right here. This is definitely lore accurate. Shattered Foss and Post Winter Foss tell story the, tell a, t tell stories about themselves to each other. What would what would this conversation be like? What, what would they? You know that one time, Antark died. <laughs> Antar got dated into the moon, and what would Sh 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 Shattered Foss say? Uh, oh yeah, all those gems are terrible. I don't know. <laughs> what would this What would this conversation entail? Oh, we have Rock Foss. Rock Foss receives a hatchet from an unknown sponsor. Who keeps giving Foss hatchets? That's like the third time Foss has received a hatchet from someone. Like a different Foss every time, but you know. Ventricos tries to treat her infection. Oh, okay. Ventricos is infected. Lore accurate. Beneteau tends- oh, I, the gun always makes me think that Beneteau is gonna be, like, violent, and then Beneteau is just doing things. Beneteau tends to lap his foss's wounds. Uh, Sonic- if Rutile was still here, uh, Rut- this would make sense for Rutile for any character. Sonic Foss lets Cinnabar into his shelter. Uh, very nice. Guys, it's our ship. I mean, um, <laughs> for those of you who ship that. Uh, Ghost says a fire, but stays hidden. It's, it sounds about right. Karen Gorman ba- <laughs> <laughs> just the, it's just funny because of these two images that's why it's funny because the, I've, the, I've i've never seen this as a ship with this specific these two specific phases of karen gorman fox this is the this is the ship he wanted right we have two different ships going on right here <laughs> Karen Gorman, baby Foss, hold hands. Um, this is this this is an interesting development. Okay, Rock Foss. <laughs> they getting violent over here. I I guess it was, Rock Foss is violent. I thought Rock Foss was supposed to be the most at peace. I'm screenshotting that, putting it in memes. Um, all right, the lore accuracy is crazy. Yeah, it's so lore accurate. I'm the one gifting Foss stuff. Congo has only acted lore accurate thus far. True. Um, my shading is like choosing a brush with a cool texture right? with that and gradients. Yes. You know Antark? Yeah, they died. You know the gems? Yeah, they died. <laughs> that is the conversation. They hold hands? No. Karen Gorm and Baby Foss makes me miss Acme and Karen Gorm. I don't know which is worse. <laughs> This should be animated. This should be animated. I completely agree. Um, the uh, next animatic idea. Honestly, I might do it. That would take a while, though. This is still so funny. Sorry, I just reread that. <laughs> Rock Foss sets Baby Foss on fire with a... M what? How do you say that? Mol oh, Molotov. Rock Foss sets Baby Foss on fire with a Molotov. Ventricosis and Beneteau Moon Foss. Be Wait, sorry. The team just came to my head. Ventricosis, Beneteau, Moon Foss, and Karen Gorm hunt for other tributes. Another whack team. There's only whack teams in this. Nothing that makes sense. Cinnabar bleeds out due to untreated injuries. No! Cinnabar's dead. To all the people who like Cinnabar. Uh, sadly. Cinnabar bleeds out to untreated injuries. Honestly, lore, lore accurate. Lore accurate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Euclid attacks post Winter Foss, uh, but manage but he manages to escape. Let's go. Um, Ghost and Lapis Foss hunt for other tributes. This is lore accurate right here. Also, Ghost and Lapis Foss, uh, lore accurate Perry. <laughs> Congo thinks about home. Of course he would. Well, now my bets are on Rock Foss. Yeah, Rock Foss is killing it. Like literally. Oh no, Cinnabar. No. You guys are delayed because stream delay, but yeah, let's go Cinnabar. Con. Are you one of those people who doesn't like Cinnabar? I guess so. Uh, Shattered Foss steals from Sonic Foss while he isn't looking. What is this like rivalry between Shattered? I I think Sonic Foss just has a rivalry with everyone. I don't know, except for who was the Sonic Foss was holding hands with? Um, was it Sonic Foss holding hands with Karen Gorm? No, it was Baby Foss holding hands with Karen Gorm. There's too many Fosses to keep track of. Uh, it's almost like they're the same person. Okay, oh, Baby Foss is dead. Wait, what happened to Baby Foss? I completely forgot. I keep forgetting who dies. 
Oh, rock. I forgot. <laughs> I keep forgetting about him, man. I'm sorry. I forgot that Rock Foss just murdered Baby Foss. Karen Gorm is single again. Uh, Congo dies. Karen Gorm went to uh, Baby Foss. And then Rock Foss murdered Baby Foss. Um, that's what happened here. <laughs> this is the fanfic writing that is happening. Um, okay. Um, Congo, Congo sees a fire but stays hidden. Uh, did I read? Yeah, ghost lap, ghost lapis foss, moon foss, and ventricosis sleep in shifts. Um, this is also a pretty lore accurate group, minus like ventricosis, I guess. Beneteau, post winter foss, and Luke Euclid sleep in shifts. These are like weird teams. I mean, not as weird, because this th these three combo kind of makes sense. Um, Beneteau, post winter foss, and Euclid. I guess that kind of makes sense. I guess a little bit. Karen Gorman. <laughs> Guys, Karen Gorm is canonically a gardening tool. <laughs> Karen Gorm is getting with every single boss. <laughs> um, Cinnabar looks like a groovy y'all. Let's go, Cinnabar. Congo thinks about home. He's sleeping again, y'all. Congo just can't forget uh, forget the doctor. Some of her ha hair looks like girl so she hair lol. Sonic Foss was was helped or helping Cinnabar. You guys are slowly shifting more and more to Foss in the voting. <laughs> Not a Cinnabar fan. Sad. The Molotov actually killed Foss. Yes, Rock Foss killed Baby Foss. Karen Gorm, sit down and chill, my dude. Right, Baby Foss just died. Karen Gorm. Karen Gorm moves on fast. What is this? <laughs> um, <laughs> so funny. Okay, next, if Shattered Foss, maybe Karen Gorm is like a death predictor, because maybe Shattered Foss will die next. Um, I also like how we went from Baby Foss to Shattered Foss. Karen Gorm has mixed standards. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> um, Sonic Foss climbs a tree to rest. That's lore accurate. Rock Foss sets up a campfire for the night. Nice. <laughs> bro, I just- Hello, bro, I just joined. Are you a Zoe- Are you a I can't speak. Are you a Hoseki Nikuni fan? Because things are wild. Let's just say things are a little wild. Um, uh, hello. Not sure they would, would hold hands. Oh. I do- Does Scat- Does Shattered Foss have a hand- Has a hand to hold? I don't know. Um, hello. Um, sorry, this is not what the stream- I'm sorry the title of the stream is wrong. It got shifted into a Hoseki no Kuni stream real fast because of someone's comment and it just had to happen. Okay, Ghost, Beneteau, Postwinter Foss, Euclid, and Sonic Foss hunt for other tributes. What is this? The teams keep getting wilder and wilder. There's there's also two Fosses. There's Sonic Foss and Post Winter Foss. You, actually, this also these are all still gem people. I guess it still works. Shattered Foss attacks Rock Foss, but he manages to escape. I'm cheering for Rock Foss right now. After Brongo died, Rock Foss is who I'm cheering for. I want Rock Foss to win because they, they they hit other baby Foss with a Molotov, and that's worth something. <laughs> okay, <laughs> um, what is this even? Uh. They would hold spikes, I guess. Yeah. Ventricosis poisons Moon Foss's drink. He drinks it and dies. Ventricosis kills Moon Foss. That is an interesting development right there. Um, Lapis Foss injures herself. L lore accurate. Congo practices his archery. Congo's just chilling. Congo like went was a menace at the beginning. Killed like three people. Um, and now he's just chilling. Karen Gorm questions her sanity. After wait, no, Shattered Foss is still alive, right? I think Karen Gorm is questioning their sanity because they bounced from Baby Foss to Shattered Foss, which is just... I don't... I would question my sanity, too. <laughs> okay. All right. One cannon shot can be heard. Moon Foss died. Moon Foss, District 3. Um, they've been old spikes. Gaslight, Gatekeep, Girl Boss, Karen Gorm. I guess. Who's alive? Okay, besides Foss, because Foss is just going to be one. Ventricosis, Euclid. Ghost, Karen Gorm, Beneteau, Congo. Okay, there's six. Um, I mean, Foss is the main contender right now. Uh, I guess we'll wait till we have more down to do another poll. 
Uh, mm-hmm. So now it's Foss, 62%, uh, Ghost and Karen Gormer, 8%, and Congo, Cinnabar, Beneteau, 31%, and still no one has voted for Ventricosis or Euclid. Back to, uh, this. Alright, Beneteau tends to rock Foss's wounds. With a gun, of course. Uh, Congo is awoken by a nightmare. Also, more accurate. This is lore accurate. Um, Ventricosis passes out from exhaustion. Is the, does this mean they're dead? I don't know. Lapis Foss taints poison Winter Foss's food, killing him. No! Post Winter Foss is dead. Sad. Do we have. Are we down to four Fosses? We can do a, something. Shattered Foss, Euclid. No, we still have more. Shattered Foss, Euclid, Sonic Foss, and Ghost sleep in shifts. Wow. I think Shattered Foss with anyone is just a whack combo. This is like maybe okay, and then there's just Shattered Foss here, like, hi guys. Karen Gorm loses sight of where she is. Karen Gorm is going insane, like, actively. Um, not only that, but Shattered Foss has obviously left Karen Gorm. <laughs> for obvious reasons. Okay. Lapis Foss and Ghost Foss split up to search for resources. This is just a lore-accurate pairing right here. Uh, Beneteau receives medical slides from an unknown sponsor. Who gave Beneteau medical supplies? I'm kidding. Uh, Rock Foss bleeds out due to untreated in- There are rock! <laughs> Actually, we can say that about every character. What am I saying? <laughs> rock Foss bleeds out due to untreated injuries. No! This- uh, Rock Foss was my MVP. Rock Foss was my vote for who was gonna win. Now I have to change it. Okay, my next vote is Beneteau. I think Beneteau's gonna win. Okay. Uh, Euclid's Ventricosis, Congo, and Sonic Foss raid Karen Gorm's camp while she is hunting. Karen Gorm is having a very bad, like, <laughs> time, is what I'm gonna say. Shattered Foss dies of- what is that? Dysentery? Sorry, I'm bad with words. Yes, I am a writing center consultant. Dysentery is an in intestinal infection that causes diarrhea containing blood and mucus. Uh, that sounds about right. With a form like that, so, lore accurate, lore accurate, lore, 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 lore accurate, okay. Um, wait, I'm gonna catch up on the chat because the chat has gone, gone places. Beneteau shoots a rock. Beneteau shoots Rock Foss. Rock Foss. Ouch! What did he get? Beneteau, sorry, that's all I know how to do. Shattered Foss would set everyone on fire. No! No, Shattered Foss dying like that? That's so funny. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Alright. Wait, only Foss died. Only Foss died this time. Post Winter Foss is dead. Rock Foss is dead. Shattered Foss is dead. See everyone's status. Who's alive? Ventricosis is still alive. Euclid is still alive. Sonic Foss is alive. Ghost is alive. Karen Gorm's alive. Um, Lapis Foss is alive. Congo and Beneteau. Oh, there's only there's only two Fosses alive. The only two Fosses alive are Sonic Foss and Lapis Foss, right? Yeah. Man, I was rooting for Rock Foss. We did have three of the Fosses die last time, so that that's what happens. Okay, go back to Fallen Tributes. Okay, Foss is 64%. Okay. Um, for those wondering, yes, the title of my stream is inaccurate, because someone made me go on a tangent. You guys will make any one of my streams that are not Hosek no Kuni related. Hosek no Kuni related. Anyway. Lapis Foss kills Beneteau with her own weapon. Lapis Foss literally took the gun from Beneteau and just shot him. <laughs> not Shattered Foss. I'm, I'm voting Karen Gorm because she's a tad crazy. I think Congo sensed Beneteau's potential. That's why he's practicing archery. Uh, who knows what's that? Congo never calmed down when you're a kid. <laughs> um, wait, Beneteau's dead? Man, everyone I keep saying is going to do it is like an automatic death flag. Okay, so, I, Beneteau's dead. Sadly. Okay, Karen Gorm, Sonic Foss, Ventricosis, and Euclid. Again, what is this combo? <laughs> Tell each other ghost stories. Ghost stories? Haha, uh -huh, about ghosts? I don't know. Ghost stories to the lightened mood. Congo dies of the same thing Shattered Foss died of. I and mean, that is not more accurate. Well, Pitapat Rock Foss has no will to live. True. Congo dies of dysentery. Uh, same, same as Shattered Foss. What? 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 Ghost accidentally didn't. 
Ghost accidentally detonates a landmine while trying to aim. Go! We can blame Karen Gorm on that one. The Karen Gorm's still in them. That that was that was their fault. <laughs> Not the gun. Thank God I was scared. Minato would win. Um Euclid decides not to go to the feast. Oh, sorry. The cornucopia is replenished with food, supplies, weapons, and memor memoirs uh, from tr the tribute families. Euclid decides not to go to the feast. Sonic Foss shoots an arrow into Lapis Foss. <laughs> Lore accurate? Into Lapis Foss's head. I mean, that's how that's how you lost your head. Anyway. Sonic Foss shoots an arrow into Lapis Foss's head. Ventricosis decides not to go to the feast. Um... Karen Gorm cannot handle this <laughs> a little more accurate. Actually, I was meant to go do a voting before this, but we can't anymore. Actually, maybe you can't. Uh, well, I guess we'll have to wait. So, Euclid decides not to go to the feast. Sonic Foss shoots an arrow at La into Lapis Foss's head. Oh, Sonic Foss is the last Foss. Sonic Foss literally took out Lapis Foss because they're like, I will be the only Foss left standing. We only have Candy Cane Leg Foss left, guys. Um... Yes. They they talk about ghost blowing up to lend the mood without a possible human Congo shatters. Uh it's true. Um Karen Gorm cannot handle the circumstances and does things. Copies Pat Paracha. Uh I thought we were we are going to draw. I was. Um and then we got distracted. <laughs> anyway. Uh Sonic Foss scares off Ventricosis. Um is this lore accurate? Not really. <laughs> Euclid receives medical supplies from another sponsor. Who sponsored Euclid? Who who's cheering for Euclid to win? No one apparently, according to the poll. But Benito died. Congo died. Ghost. Wait. Oh yeah, Ghost blew themselves up. Ghost died. Lapis Foss died. Uh, Sonic Foss killed Lapis Foss, and Karen Gorm committed suicide. Uh, okay, who, who do we have left? Okay, we have Ventricosis, Euclid, Sonic Foss. Ooh, we only have three. Okay, guys, we're down to the final three. Time to vote. I can't believe Euclid has made it this far. I didn't expect Euclid to make this far. Oh, let me end poll. Those are your options for the poll. I think everyone else is dead. Yeah, everyone else is dead. <laughs> we're going to draw. Hey, yeah, uh, the cannon cane. Uh, Karen Gorm had no one to hook up with. <laughs> So they just left the game. True. That is exactly what happened to Karen Gorm. Karen Gorm only had. Oh, wait. Ver Karen Gorm only had Ventricosis, Euclid, or Sonic Foss, and just said, nah. Um, what y'all playing? Uh, Hunger, game sim uh, Hunger Game Simulator with Jose no Kuni characters. And we're voting on who's winning. That We have Ventricosis, Sonic Foss, and Euclid are the candidates. Uh, everyone else is dead. Um, it's so funny. How, how's the pool doing? We have Ventricosis 11%, Euclid 22%, uh, Sonic Foss 67%. Uh, people are voting for Euclid. Ventricosis versus Euclid versus Sonic Foss? Yeah, it's so whack. Um, you, you have Kirby as your YouTube profile picture. It's so different from your Discord. <laughs> Sonic Foss is canon now. Yay. Uh, art. Uh -huh. Quite literally Sonic Foss. You know, this is, this is very thematic since Sonic Foss is the only one left. Um, yeah. Bring this over. Oh, it just changed as I took a screenshot of it. Uh, it, it the poll keeps changing. Whoops, did I? <laughs> I just messed up the stream. Ignore that. Okay. <laughs> All right. So. <laughs> so it was Ventros is twenty percent. Euclid twenty percent. Sonic Foss uh twenty percent. Fifty or sixty percent. But now it is. Uh, Ventricosis is now 18%. Where is my thing? Ventricosis is now 18%, Euclid is now 27%, and Sonic Boss is now 55%. Alrighty. <laughs> um, I wonder what they're doing. And here is a word from our sponsor. Shows art. Yeah. Apparently, you guys are- technically this true. It's okay, Sonic Boss is meant to be killed. Isn't candy cane mint flavored? What? Is candy cane mint flavored? Yes. Foss is a mint color. Yes, sure. Foss is mint flavored. Foss winter Foss gif is literally, literally me when I think about life. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this, this is you? Yeah. All right, let's see. Go to the following tributes. Beneteau, dead. Congo, dead. Ghost. 
dead. Uh, Lapis Foss dead. Karen Gorm dead. Let's proceed. Sonic Foss dies. No. <laughs> Foss isn't winning this one. Foss can't win the. Foss is so depressed they can't even win the Hunger Games that is set out for them. Uh, Sonic Foss dies from an infection. Euclid begs Ventru for Ventricosa to kill him. Uh, she reluctantly obliges killing Euclid's Ventricosis won! <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> this is such a wild turn of events. Sonic Paws dies of a vengeance. You would Ventricosis. Oh my gosh. The winner is Ventricosis from District 1. Woo! <laughs> it's so funny. It's so wacky. <laughs> Andrikosis wins. <laughs> yep. Yeah, all of you are just crying and sad. Benito with a gun killed me. <laughs> it killed me too. Benito with a gun is just so funny. Uh, proceed. Okay. Oh, we get to see their kills now. Right. Uh, this is accurate. Yuk wants to die. That is true. <laughs> One of the flesh ones. Yukos made it to second with zero kills and then wanted to die. This is pure chaos. This really is. Okay. The stream title for is totally accurate, guys. Okay, guys, we're gonna go through the kills, all right? Ventricosis had three kills. Euclid, second place, had no kills. Sonic Foss, uh, third place, had two kills. Didn't, who did Sonic, Sonic Foss kill? Karen Gorm had no kills, but it came in fourth place. Uh, Lapis Foss, three kills, lore accurate. Fifth place, Ghost Foss, sixth place, no kills. Congo had two kills. Congo got two kills at the beginning and then just stopped. Um, <laughs> 7th place, Benito, 8th place, Shattered Foss had 3 kills, lore accurate, um, 9th place, Rock Foss had 1 kill, Rock Foss killing someone is so funny, didn't Rock Foss, no, Rock Foss died earlier, who did Rock Foss, Rock Foss killed Baby Foss, it's so funny, um, Post Winter Foss, 11th place, 1 kill, Moon Foss had no kills, not lore accurate, uh, District 3, Cinnabar had no kills, uh, lore accurate, um, Baby Foss had 1 kill, who did Baby Foss kill? I forgot who, who, who did Baby Foss kill? I don't even remember. Did, oh no, Baby Foss killed Shattered Foss, didn't they? <laughs> it's so funny. Pitapat, uh, fifth two plays, didn't get a single kill. Invasion Foss didn't get a single fill, to kill. Invasion Foss was curing people's wounds, or, that's d, &D terms. Invasion Foss was, uh, was tending to people's wounds, which is so funny. Afia had no kills, haha. <laughs> Pebble drowned. <laughs> Uh, Prayer Foss got smited by Congo. Antark got killed by Post Winter Foss, which is so funny. Padpa killed themselves. Uh, Rutile. What happened to Rutile? Rutile died. I forgot how Rutile died. I think, um, Baby Foss blew them up or something. Or one of the Fosses blew Rutile up. Mercury Foss died, and Nothingness also died. And the, they're in last base. Uh, Nothingness got. Uh, Nothingness was the first to die, which is kind of funny. No one gets Nothingness. Lore accurate. Lore accurate. Only lore, the most lore accurate of things happen. Um, so, so funny. Um, anyway. <laughs> that was so chaotic. <laughs> um, this is accurate. Uh, this is pure chaos. Ventricosis was a plot twist. No one saw it coming. Yeah, I did not think Ventricosis would win. I wonder, when ha I wonder how they animate the killing process. Uh, the Admiral... Lives are short, but Ventricosis lived the longest. It's so funny. The fact that Ventricosis won against all these immortals is hilarious. Benito with zero kills. Did she point the gun to herself? Benito tried to kill... I think so. Benito begged for their life... For, like, Moonfoss to kill them, and then, yeah. Poor Pebble. A what? Yeah. Top five reasons why don't use men humor to girls. What? Uh... This whole stream is actually canon, you guys. Yeah, this is this is exactly what's going to happen in 107. Ventricosis is going to come back from the grave um, and is going to throw Rock Foss onto the ground and shatter them again. And that is going to be 107. That is my 100% accurate 107 predictions, guys. Um, yeah. All right. Um, back to drawing? <laughs> This is what I'll tell my kids when they ask me about Hoseki no Kuni. Perfect representation. R true. Bro, are you gonna draw? <laughs> that, I'm, I'm, that's what the stream says. 
the, the, you guys came for me drawing, right? You didn't come for the Hunger Games uh, gem shenanigan, did you? Uh, I don't want to falsely advertise that I'm going to be doing a drawing stream when instead we're going to be putting uh, Jose no Kuni characters in a hung the Hunger Games simulator. Like, I would never do that to you guys. I would never want to lie to you like that. <laughs>